Today, we shall see some review questions on DNA replication. There are some review questions. We will see that question is an answer. Let us continue. The first part is true and false. The question number one is the gap formed due to removal of pri primary is filled by DNA ligase enzyme. Is it true or false? Think on it. Is it true or false? The gap formed due to removal of primaries filled by DNA ligase enzyme. What do you think? Is it true? No, it is a false. It is a false actually. Because the reason is the gap formed due to removal of primaries filled by DNA polymerase. It is filled by DNA polymerase. DNA ligase enzyme filled the gap that is Okazaki fragment. Okazaki fragment. So the answer is false. Question number two. DNA replication occur before cell division. Is it true or false? There is a cell division. There is a DNA replication. What do you think an answer? Think on it. Is it true? Yes. The answer is true. The answer is true. The answer is definitely true. You know, there is what you call cell cycle. The cell cycles are interphase stage M or mitosis stage and the cytokinesis three phases at the interphase stage of cell division cell cycle there is gap one S and gap two phase in gap, gap one the cell increase in size in S phase, there is a replication. In G2 phase, the cell again increases in size and prepare itself for division. In M phase, you know, so many things happen. Mitosis, meiosis, chromosome, division. Then finally, at the cytokinesis, actual cytoplasm cell division of so that DNA replication proceed cell division DNA replication occur before cell division it occur at the interface stage of cell cycle particularly at the S phase question number three lagging strand is the new strand that grows continuously toward this replication fork. There is a replication fork. Is it true or false? Lagging strand is the new strand that grows continuously toward this the replication fork. What do you think? Is it true? No, actually it is false. The reason is lagging strand synthesize away from the replication fork. Two, lagging strand synthesize discontinuously. 
not continuously, not continuously, discontinuously. Again, it is our way replication fault. Because of these two points, the answer is false. Question number four. The new DNA strand formed after DNA replication is an exact copy of its parent strand. Is it true or false? What do you think? This question. The new DNA strand formed after DNA replication is an exact copy of its parent strand. Is it false? Think on it, please. Okay. The answer is true. The answer is true. The answer is true. The new strand, the daughter form it is exact copy of parent strand. It is from the parent strand. So it is exact copy. It is exact copy. DNA, there is a parent strand. After DNA replication, there will be daughter strand. That daughter strand is exact copy of parent strand. So the answer is true. Question number five. Pentose sugar in DNA is linked to nitrogenous base by hydrogen bond to form nucleoside. What do you think this question? Please think on it. Okay. Is it true or false? It is false. False. Look at pentose sugar, you know, in a given nucleotide, there is a phosphate, there is a pentose sugar, and a nitrogenous base. Pentose sugar is connected to nitrogenous base actually by glycosidic bond, by glycosidic bond, not by hydrogen bond. It is by glycosidic bond by glycosidic bond so the answer is false the answer is false question number six question number six two strand of dna linked by phosphodiester bond two strand of dna linked by phosphodiester bond what do you think this question? What do you think? Is it true or false? It is false. Because Two strands of DNA is linked by hydrogen bond. You know DNA is a double strand. Two strands is connected by hydrogen bond. Nitrogenous bases are pairing. So hydrogen bond connect two strands together. Because of that reason, the answer is false. Part two, the choice. Question number one. The accepted mode of DNA replication is known as A, conservative, B, semi-conservative, C, dispersive, D, complementarity. What is the an answer?
Okay. You know, there are three modes of DNA replication. Dispersive, conservative, and semi-conservative. According to dispersive, there is breaking of DNA fragments into pieces, then there will be random reassociation. That is dispersive, something a random process. This model is not accepted, it is rejected. The conservative mode is nothing is changed, nothing is changed, nothing is changed, nothing is changed. So that is a conservative, nothing will change. No sentences of strand upon existing new strand. Actually, this conservative mode is also rejected. The accepted mode is semi-conservative. According to semi-conservative, upon each strand of parent strand, daughter strand will be synthesized. Daughter strand will be synthesized. So at the end, there is a daughter, there is old strand and a new strand. That is semi-conservative. So the answer is semi Conservative. The answer is semi conservative. The answer is semi conservative. Question number two. In a molecule of doubly stranded DNA, the amount of adenine present in is always equal to the amount of dash. In molecule of doubly stranded DNA, the amount of adenine present is always equal to the amount of dash. What do you think an answer? The amount of adenine. Think on it, please. Okay. You know, adenine always carries thiamine. Adenine carries thiamine. Cytosine Peru is guanine. Guanine. So that according to charge of rule, adenine is equal to thiamine. So the answer is C. The answer is C. Question number three. Which sequence of DNA bases would repair? Let me repeat. Which sequence of DNA bases would pair with this partial strand of 5 prime A T G T G A C A G 3 prime? Which of the, these alternative sequence can pair with this the given sequence? What do you think? Think on it. Look at you know. The strand of DNA is antiparallel. Adenine always produces thiamine, cytosine always produces guanine. If one strand is oriented from 5 to 3 direction, the opposite one is oriented from 3 to 5 direction. So here, what will happen here is 3 prime instead of adenine, thiamine, instead of thiamine, Adenine, here is a guanine, so cytosine, here is thiamine, adenine, here is guanine, cytosine, here is adenine, thiamine, here is cytosine, guanine, here is adenine, thiamine, 
Here is guanine cytosine. This one is five prime, three prime. So here should be five prime. So which is correct? A, it's not correct. It's not correct. B, also not correct. C, three prime, thiamine, adenine, cytosine, adenine, cytosine, thiamine, guanine, thiamine, cytosine. So this one is correct. What about this? Five prime. Here is three prime. So this is not correct. The answer is C. The last question. Which of these is a function of DNA? A. Replicate cells. B. Create genome. C. Store information. Store genetic information. D. Nen. What do you think? Okay. The answer is store genetic information. Genetic information. The main function of DNA. It is store and it transmit genetic information. Thank you for watching this video. Subscribe, comment and share this video. Thank you very much.